I'll use these two methods to create a gradient bar chart. To build the structure, we'll first put sales type into the rows and measure values into the columns. In the measure values, create a new calculated field called the minimum of zero. And we can get rid of the count of the data and keep only the sum of the sales amount. To make the gradients work, we need to translate it into a line and make the measure names the path. Then increase the size so that it looks like bars. I'll start with my favorite method, which is using measure names. Add measure names into the marks and change it from detail to color. Now we can edit the colors using the legend and choose two colors. For the second method, use measure values instead of measure names. We can edit the colors in the legend and choose the custom diverging, then choose two colors. 